Let Garmin show you how to upgrade your Zoom XT with the Group Ride accessory. This will allow you to create and join group rides with other Zoom XT and Garmin Tread users. A wireless helmet headset can be paired with the Zoom XT to transmit your voice over the radio. We will need the Zoom XT, Group Ride accessory, high current power cable, two ring terminals, a wire crimping tool, and the Group Ride radio antenna. The ring terminals are included, but the size needed may vary upon your motorcycle's battery. First, we will need to uninstall the Zumo XT motorcycle mount and power cable. To begin, remove the Zumo XT from the motorcycle mount. Then, remove the motorcycle mount from the double socket arm. Next, you will need to remove the wiring harness. Start by removing the grounding wire of the wiring harness from the grounding terminal. Next, remove the positive wire from the battery's positive terminal. Once the Zumo XT power cable has been removed, we can install the high current power cable for the group ride accessory. Garmin strongly recommends having an experienced installer with the proper knowledge of electrical systems install the device. Incorrectly wiring the power cable can result in damage to the vehicle or the battery and can cause bodily injury. See the important safety and product information guide in the product box for product warnings and other important information. The group ride accessory and high current power cable must be installed in a suitable and secure location on your motorcycle, based on available power sources and safe cable routing. Other bikes may have a wiring requiring other solutions not covered in this video. Refer to an experienced installer. Now it's time to wire the high current power cable to your motorcycle. First, it is important to choose an accessible wiring path for the cables. Your ideal path will vary depending on the model of your motorcycle. The power converter for the high current power cable is located near one end of the cable. You may choose or need to reduce the length of the high current power cable for a proper installation. Do not remove the power converter when cutting the wire. The ring terminals connect the high current power cable directly to the battery terminals. Now you will need to begin to attach the high current power cable. Start by attaching the positive wire to the battery's positive terminal. Then, attach the grounding wire from the high current power cable to the grounding terminal on the battery. Now that you have wired your power cable, it is time to attach the group ride accessory. Insert the ball in the group ride accessory into the double socket arm. Then, tighten the knob slightly. If necessary, rotate the group ride accessory so that the Garmin logo faces up. Adjust the mount for better viewing and operation. Then, tighten the knob to secure the accessory. Press the Zumo XT into the group ride accessory until it snaps into place. Ensure the device is secured. Then, connect the group ride accessory power cable to the connector on the high current power cable. Finally, tighten the collar to secure the connected power cables. Next, we'll install the group ride radio antenna. For the best range performance, use the antenna mounting kit. Or, screw down and tighten the antenna onto the group ride accessory. And that's it. For more help, please visit support.garmin.com. Thanks for watching.